Okay, these days, man, people have the wrong idea of what the word diet means, okay? And I'm gonna break it down for you. Let's talk about it. What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Urban Minds Inc. Representing that positivity and that motivation. Hey, listen, man. Like I said, man, New Year's is upon us. 2021 isn't gonna be a bust. You know what I'm saying? This is the year where you will prosper. This is the year where you will experience increase and you'll be in God's favor. But let me get something clear, man. There's gonna be a flood, an influx of people having new diets, new trends and things like that this New Year's. It's happening all the time. But people do this around New Year's because they want your money. So check it out. Somebody says, hey, I got the diet for you, okay? The word diet itself just means food consumption. Now, when you talk about diet, when somebody asks you, hey man, are you dieting? Or are you like, I'm on a diet? That doesn't mean just eating healthy. Diet is general food consumption. Whether you're eating pizza, pop tarts, chicken nuggets, fries, you know, everybody is on a diet. Everybody is dieting. You know, every day that you eat, you're dieting. Either you're dieting or you're fasting. One of the two. So don't always think the word diet is healthy because it's not. I can eat pizzas every day of my life and call that my diet. It is my diet. It's the food that I consume. So anything with the word diet attached to it does not mean it's healthy. That's coming from your boy, certified nutritionist, okay? So what you should aim to do is clean up your diet. Clean up your diet towards your desired goal. What is the outcome you want, okay? You wanna be leaner or you just wanna lose weight or you wanna burn fat. You have to clean up your diet, the diet that you already have. You have to clean it up in order to achieve the desired outcome. If you want a dog gonna get lean, you know, for most people, the average American, that's gonna include lowering them carbs, lowering them carbs because the American diet is high in carbs, high in fat, low in protein. So to lean out is very simple. Keep your fats very moderate, keep your protein high and your carbs low, and you're gonna lean out. It's just nothing, nothing else needs to be said about that. You wanna lose, you wanna lose, doggone, uh, just lose weight in general, lower your calories. Create a, cal a caloric deficit by doing exercise or eating less, and you will achieve that goal, okay? Calories in versus calories out. But when you talk about diet, man, I want you guys to be aware that you're gonna start seeing all your 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 successful or your 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 popular um, fitness personalities. Dog gonna use this word diet, and they gonna be like, I got the millennial diet, I got the 2021 diet. And sometimes, if you don't have a trained eye to know what to look for, you're gonna fall victim to something that you're not gonna be able to keep up in the long run. See me, I'm always advocating. I'm always advocating good, a good, clean diet, okay? That's incorporating vegetables, making sure you get those micronutrients, those vitamins, those minerals, you know, a good amount of protein to sustain the body mass that you have, the, the muscular uh, frame that you have, and then a moderate fat to, you know, maintain hormone balance in the body, brain function, and things like that. You know, if you're somebody that loves fruit, you know what I'm saying? Fruit is very dense in uh, calories, has a lot of vitamins and things like that, but it's also very caloric, very calorically dense and contains fructose. That's gonna be detrimental to your, your doggone weight loss. You somebody that likes to snack, potato chips, cookies, things like that, you're gonna have to start limiting yourself if you wanna achieve your goal. Now, if you're following, uh, if it fits your macro approach, you can use that but you wanna make sure that protein is high. That protein needs to be the highest one up out of all of your macros, okay? And I'll break it down. I'll break it down later, the macros and things like that in later videos. So don't fall a victim to some of these faddish and trendy diets coming out in the new years. Some diets that you can stick to is a good, healthy, clean diet where you're eating lots of protein, lots of vegetables, 
and uh, mod uh, moderate level fat, clean sources of fat. And then, you know, they call it a fasting diet. Well, fasting and dieting don't have anything to do at the same time. The timing that you eat your food or the window that you fast does not have anything to do with the word diet. And that's just uh, my advice to you. Hope it helps you out in your journey on 2021 because it's not going to be a bust, man. Stay humble, stay hard, stay blessed. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. Holler back at your boy because I'm only shooting it gun barrel straight.